how to design a vintage graphic tee. Open up a new project, use control and backspace to make the background black. Place your image, I'm gonna cut the top half of this one off because I don't need it. If the background's fairly clean, you can go to select then subject, click the mask button. At this stage, just place some assets in the rough area that you wanna put them. For this lightning, I'm gonna scroll through the blend modes until something looks good. I'm placing a levels adjustment layer on top of the lightning and taking down the shadows until I only see the lightning. I'm applying another mask to the lightning and removing the parts I don't need. Adding a shadow behind just to create some contrast. I'm adding another layer mask just to remove the bottom half of the angel. Type in your text, I have no idea what to write here. Choose a nice font. This font plus all textures and resources will be in the description. Convert the text to a smart object and create a new document. Place in a texture that has some variation to it and save it as a PSD document. Go back to your design and with the text selected, go to Effect, Distort, Displace. Click OK, then find the displacement file that you just saved. When displacing your text, it will give a slight variation. Add some color to your text, duplicate the text and add a different color. Set the blend mode to dissolve, apply a mask, and then use a black brush to wipe away the bottom half. I didn't like the color, so I changed it. Duplicate the original text, move it to the top, then apply our inner glow. Use a slightly lighter variation. Then make the fill zero. This will show the bottom two layers, but keep the inner glow. Get a plastic texture, which is in the description. Control click on the text layer, and then click the mask button. Play around with some blending modes until something looks good. On top of the cloud, we're adding a solid color layer. Control click to select the cloud and mask it. Change blending modes until it looks good. With your text selected, go to effects, filter gallery. Add graphic pen for the bottom layer. Make the stroke length low. Play around with the light and dark balance until it looks good. Add another layer with stamp. Just change that until it looks good. Change the blending mode and opacity until it looks good. Do the exact same thing to the angel. I did it twice, one focused on the body and one focused on the wings. Then I just masked it to show both. Add some more text, apply another displacement, make a new layer, Control alt shift e to merge everything into one. Apply some textures, change blending mode, add a gradient map, my pack is in the description. Scroll through